So I got a question from Nashville the other day. It goes like this. Antonio, I want to wear black dress shoes with jeans. All my accessories are black. What color dress shoes do you recommend if black is a no-go? Thank you, Dean. Thanks, Dean. It's a good question. The answer is a little bit complicated and I'll explain why in today's video. So the question is, can you wear blue jeans with black shoes? And on the surface, the answer should be no. You shouldn't mix casual blue jeans with formal black shoes. But the real world answer is a little bit more complicated because of all the options out there when it comes to black shoes and all the options out there when it comes to blue jeans. So let me explain this with a Venn diagram. So right here, we've got black shoes. Over here, we've got blue jeans. This was 50 years ago. Notice how they are not touching each other. But over the last 50 years, what has happened? These two have come closer together. We now have tons of styles of black shoes that are going to be much more casual. And we have tons of styles of jeans, which are going to be a little bit dressier. So as you can see, the answer nowadays isn't as cut and dry. It really depends on the style and the formality of the shoe and the type of jeans that we're trying to match it with. Now, historically, black dress shoes, especially made in a style with a closed lacing system, were reserved for formal wear and for business wear. Basically, dark colored suits are where we saw this type of footwear being worn. Now, over the last 50 to 70 years, we've seen a number of styles emerge, much more casual styles. We see open lacing systems. We see slip on loafers like what we have here with this monk strap. This is going to be a much more casual style. So although it's a black shoe, this is something that you can dress down and you can wear with odd trousers. You could actually even wear with possibly dark colored jeans. And some black colored shoes, it seems they're actually designed. They call for more casual type of trousers. This right here isn't going to look good, in my opinion, with a suit. What's this going to work with? Dark colored jeans. And now switching to the other side, let's look at jeans. Over a hundred years ago, this was the uniform of the working man. And still today, working men around the world leverage jeans. But what's happened in the last 30 to 40 years? We've seen designers jump on jeans. It started happening in the 50s, 60s, 70s. But it wasn't until the 1980s and 90s that we saw the fits adjust. All of a sudden, jeans became much more accepted and nowadays they are seen as a classic in a man's wardrobe. And with so many designs, so many cuts, we've also got a wide variety of colors. And something interesting happens whenever you go darker with denim. We're talking black, dark gray, or indigo. In my opinion, all of a sudden, it's something that you can start even matching with a sports jacket. You can start to level up and all of a sudden, we see these two circles getting closer and starting to have overlap. So a pair of black jeans with a tapered cut, well, it seems to me there's going to be a natural fit with a pair of black shoes, especially those black boots. And there are some colors out there that work really well with black. So you get a pair of slim cut jeans in maroon, mix them right here with those monk straps in black, perfect combination. Well-fitted gray denim with a pair of black Gucci horse bit loafers? Why not? Now, of course, there's still going to be plenty of instances where this combination doesn't work. Most jeans that have a distinctive blue, lighter colored denim, distressed denim. This right here is going to be more casual, isn't in general going to work with most black shoes, especially the black shoes that are more formal in design. Now, what about brown? What about oxblood? In general, these colors are going to work much better with denim. Why? Because they are much more casual shoes. Not only are these styles right here going to be more casual, but the colors make it so that they're going to work with more casual type trousers. Now, one thing I love about Oxblood is if you already have a collection of black shoes, this is going to be easy to introduce. Notice the sole right here is black. So this will work with your black accessories. Dean, you said you probably already got maybe a few belts, maybe some of your watch straps are black. Point being is you could easily bring in Oxblood to your collection and you'd probably get a lot of miles because you'd be able to match it with a lot of your jeans. Now, personally, when I look at my shoe collection, it is dominated by browns. I got nothing against black, but to me, it's too stark of a contrast with most of the clothing I want to wear. I found that brown just suits me better, so I gravitate towards it. But if you've already got a lot of black in your wardrobe, you can also look at gray shoes. You can again look at Oxblood to add it to supplement. But what I like about brown is just its flexibility. So many different shades from dark, and I've got this with a suede. You can go to mid-colored brown. You can go with just a tan right here for the summer. Uh, 
even this pair of brown shoes, a little bit darker, but still relatively casual. We can tell by that open lacing system, which makes the shoes more casual. But these right here, I'd have to say I'd still, maybe I could wear them with dark colored denim, but in general, because of the contrast, I'd probably actually wear these with a pair of gray flannels or maybe lighter colored odd trousers. So, in summary, my answer is yes, you can wear more formal jeans with more casual black dress shoes because there's overlap. But if we have the opposite, you've got those casual jeans trying to mix them with the dress shoes, probably not a good combination. Now, gents, I know you've got an opinion. I want to hear from you down in the comments. Do you agree? Black shoes with jeans, yes or no? So, what video to watch next? Well, how about how to save your shoes from mud and grime? Now, gents, for this video, we got these shoes super dirty, had a lot of fun, and go check out how we cleaned them up, how we got them looking brand new.